Hello, Startup Vision. I am Philippe Guillot, and I am a co-founder and CEO of Matchtune. Hello, Philippe. Nice to be with you today. So you're the co-founder with the famous musician composer André Manoukian of Matchtune, a startup which is all about music and uh, AI. And you were telling me something really disturbing that only 0.01% you know, of uh, the music created in the world uh, generates revenue. So can you explain how much, uh, much tune works and what it is? Yes, actually, this is a very sad story, I'm going to say, because it, there are about 150 million uh, music tracks on this planet and uh, only 0.1% of this enormous, you know, uh, quantity of music actually generate revenue for their, uh, for, for their authors. And um, uh, so we have been trying to understand why, you know. Um, well, it's, it's basically very simple. It's because between the offer, which is all these large catalogs, and the demand, which is all these large uh, video business and digital business, um, they actually don't talk to each other for three reasons. Uh, the first reason is that when, uh, uh, let's say I'm a video maker and I, I'm looking for some music uh, because there are so many music available and I am not you know, a, a musician, uh, I'm gonna have a hard time looking for the right music for my video. So I have to you know, look through large catalogs with keywords, etc., and it's time consuming and it's a cost. Uh, the, the second problem is that let's say I end up finding the right music I mean, the music I like, uh, this music is going to be, let's say, three minutes. And uh, my video is uh, 25 seconds. So what do I do with the three minutes music on my, you know, uh, 25 seconds video? I have to re-edit the music. And again, I'm not a, a pro, you know, and I don't want to spend too much money on that. And finally, the last problem is that once you have, let's say, done all that, uh, well, music needs to match, you know, with the, with the video, meaning that, it, when in the video you have uh, uh, moments, uh, it needs to match moments into the music. And most of the time, because the video and the music were not made you know, to be together, uh, it just doesn't happen. So Mash Tune solves all these three problems. And, uh, uh, and this is why we, we created this company. And your market seems to be huge because as uh, Stephanie Hospital from uh, the VC One Right Time says, you know, in the next two years, and I quote her, video content is expected to represent 80% of all internet traffic. And I can tell you, Philippe, as a video content creator myself, uh, I totally agree with her. Yes, uh, this is a huge market. So. I'm gonna say it's a waste. It's a waste for uh, uh, music, music um, uh, money making, you know, monetization. Uh, so, uh, 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 so, so we are we are trying to to work, you know, uh, to be like the bridge between these large catalogs on one side and the, this digital growing market on the other side through um, our technology. Uh, so right now, you know, we uh, uh, we are working with the majors. Uh, so uh, they are all coming to us because they believe that uh, we are going to be uh, this bridge that will bring them to this market that is hard for them to really understand. Definitely. Uh, with Matchtune and the evolution, as we saw, of more and more uh, video content, it's, isn't it finally a stable business model that uh, you're offering and a better future for music creators that you propose? Definitely, because you know, right now, let me give you an example. Let's say you, uh, you, 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 you know, music, you put your music on, on Spotify, uh, you need to have 100,000 listening to, uh, to get $400 revenue. You know, it's, I mean, it's huge. And when you know that about 20,000 new tracks are being added daily on, uh, on Spotify, uh, I mean, you are better off taking a, a lottery ticket, you know. So, uh, so in our case, we simplified completely the process of uh, finding music, purchasing music, and clearing all the rights. Uh, so, uh, uh, so, I mean, everything gets simple, and the, uh, the, the author gets actually a big chunk of the revenue of the music right away, you know, without waiting like the end of the year to get some kind of royalties. 
Yeah, this is great because in fact, what you propose is a win-win situation for uh, musicians, majors, producers, and customers also. So, because you make it easier to comply uh, with the copyright uh, uh, problems, you know, which is always very tricky, very complicated. So how does it work with MatchTune? Well, that was another big problem is that, you know, uh, copyright, uh, royalties, these are kind of words that the digital market don't understand. So we had to really simplify this. So we went to uh, these large music catalogs and we told them, you know, you need to speak their language. So basically, when someone is going to buy your music, you know, uh, uh, he has included into the, the you know, the, the purchase, he has a three-year license for this music and he can use it anywhere he wants, you know, on the digital, uh, without having to uh, uh, worry about, you know, uh, rights, royalties, and, 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 and stuff like that. And they accepted that. So we really s simplified the process of, uh, you know, uh, looking for the music, uh, uh, using the music, and uh, being able to use it anywhere without any issue. And, and people who, who go through MatchTune, um, just pay for what they get, in fact. It's, uh, they don't have to look uh, all over to, to, to know what's the price of so-and-so, you know, this music or another one. You have a special fee for, for that kind of music, is that it? Yes, actually we have different, you know, different products for different markets. But basically you could come to uh, MatchTune, you can drop your video, we are going to analyze the video and we are going to come back in a few seconds. Uh, with let's say 10 suge music suggestions for your video, which are already assembled for your video. So you can play your video right away and, uh, and you will see uh, like the best tracks that could go with your video right away on this video. And uh, so, so these are really for like the brands company, you know, the ad agencies, etc. Now on the other side, there are a lot of companies that are making what we call automatic video. Uh, um, and uh, in this case, we just create a kind of pipe, you know, where we are going to deliver in a few seconds uh, um, custom and, and already uh, 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 scaled uh, music for their video. And there is no human interaction, you know? So it's like, you know, it's like, it's like a pipe of water, if you want so. Yeah, and, and uh, of course, behind that, there is a lot of uh, engineering, AI research. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Yes, so uh, the, the, the most difficult here is uh, actually to remove all the, you know, the bias of, uh, of uh, uh, analyzing these catalogs because most of them have been uh, previously tagged by human. And, uh, you know, someone could uh, see rock for music, but maybe uh, his neighbor, you know, will say it's not rock, it's something else. So we had to really use uh, artificial intelligence to uh, remove all the bias of an, the analysis and the ingestion of all these large catalogs. And secondly, the most difficult was actually to be able to uh, analyze a video, select the best tracks, assemble the tracks in a question of three to four seconds. Yeah. You know, because if you have to wait three minutes or 10 minutes to get the results, I mean, uh, basically, uh, you know, you, you, you are going to some, somewhere else. Absolutely, this is, this is huge. So what's next for MatchTune now? Well, MatchTune is going to, to, right now we have a lot of traction, we have a lot of catalogs coming to us, so we are going to increase that uh, uh, music uh, offering, if you want so. And on the other side, we are going to be more and more precise on uh, you know, video analysis and music suggestions. We are going to work on something new, which we call audience. You know, because for instance, uh, we, uh, uh, you know, someone who is working on a video, uh, an ad agency, maybe they want, you know, like uh, a music that is going to be good for someone, a teenager from 16 to 25 year old, uh, you know, uh, from this country or that country, etc. So we call it audience. And this is a new kind of classification of music. Yeah, that's very interesting because that's what I was thinking, you know, I mean, different tastes in different parts of the world. So you really have to be really clever and organized to know all those uh, cultural bias, if I may. That's right. Well, this is great. Thank you, Philippe, for sharing all that and uh, for doing uh, so much for the music that we love. Thank you. for. Thank you so much.
Bye-bye. Bye-bye.